In the ever-evolving landscape of artificial intelligence, Google has once again shocked the world with its amazing feature called SGE. This revolutionary tool is not just a massive improvement in artificial intelligence. It is a paradigm shift that could change the way we interact with the digital world. Imagine a search engine that can understand your intent so well that it can give you the exact answer you need. A search engine that can help us with creating art to solving complex problems. That is the future SGE promises to create. Before we dive further into the video, make sure to show some love by clicking the like button and also subscribe to the channel for more AI content. First of all, let's know what SGE is. SGE stands for Search Generative Experience. It's a new Google search feature that uses AI to generate more relevant and personalized search results. Imagine you are looking for a book in a library. You would have to search through the library catalog and then find the book on the shelf. SGE is like a librarian who can help you find the book you are looking for and even give you recommendations for other books you might like to read. But the question raises, how does it work? SGE uses LLM, a large language model, to generate text and answer your question in an informative way. When you enter a question or query into SGE, the LLM first tries to understand the intent of your query. What are you really looking for? Once it understands your intent, the LLM will generate a response that is related to your query. Are you ready to see this new feature? Let's ask for some restaurants near me. As you can see, we got the same old interface, except at the top we have this new option that says get an AI-powered overview for the search. Let's click the Generate button to see what we get. On the left side, SGE generates a list of restaurants with ratings and reviews. On the right side, there are some additional search results that show 10 to 15 websites. So, as you can see, SGE provides the summaries of the web pages. Now let me ask, what is the capital of France? As you can see, we got Paris with three lines of information. This short text is called Featured Snippet, which is a text from a web page that is displayed at the top of the search results page in a box above the organic listings. But it's short, and for more information, you have to enter the website. SGE, on the other hand, provides summaries of the topics in an informative way which is also killing SEO because now you don't have to enter multiple websites for the information. SGE can provide you the information with just one click. Additionally, we have this follow-up option that allows you to ask for additional information without having to start a new search. This is useful when you have a question that is related to your original search, but not exactly the same. We also heard from Google that this feature lets you generate images directly from the search bar. Let's see if that is true. Let's ask for a beautiful picture of Mario. It actually generated images right here in the search bar. Here are some additional images that SGE generated. We all agree that the images generated by SGE are not as good as other image generators. Due to being in its experimental phase, however, as SGE continues to improve, I expect that its ability to generate images may get better. Before we end the video, there are some points worth mentioning. First, SGE is not available worldwide. It's only available in Japan, India, and the United States. Second, there is no exact information on when it's going to be available worldwide. Third, for those of you who are not from those countries but are curious to use it, Leave a comment and let me know whether you want access to SGE or not. And that was it for today, guys. I hope you have learned something from this video. If so, subscribe to the channel and on top of that, smash the like button. With all that being said, I'm going to meet each and every single one of you down in the comment section below. Take care.